Hi everyone, today in word work we are going to be looking at spelling patterns and how spelling patterns can help us read a word. All right, so I'm going to write a few words on my piece of paper and I want you to notice something about all these words or what do these words have in common? So I have rib, bib, and crib. What do you notice about all of these words? All right, so I hope that you have noticed that they all end, oops, in I, B. Okay, let's think of another word that ends in I, B. Thinking fib, like a lie, you say a fib. Okay. All right. I want you to look at these words and tell me what do they all have in common or what do you notice about these words? Stem, gym, problem. What do these words have in common? All right, hopefully that you've noticed that they all end in E-M. Okay, let's come up with some words that also end in E-M. I'm thinking of them. Go ahead and come up with one more word that ends in E-M. All right, I was thinking of the word anthem, but you could have come up with anything that ends in E-M. All right, what do you not notice about all of these words? Mud, bud, and cud. What do you notice about those words? Mud, like a Like a pile of mud, bud, like your friend, or a flower bud, and cud is something that a cow chews on. What do you know about all of these words? All right, they all end in U, D, or UD. So what are some words that you can come up with that end in U, D? All right, I thought of the word thud, and hopefully you came up with some more words. All right, last one. What do you notice about all of these words? Bus, plus, circus, and focus. What do you notice about all of these words? All right, hopefully you notice that they all end in U-S. So now I want you to come up with some words that end in U-S.
All right, I came up with the word cactus. Bonus and minus. Hopefully you came up with some other words.